take a look over there at the house and garden. It's almost like they said, what colour do we want our shop front? Let's have concrete colour. Say what? G'day interwebs, it's Kramer. Welcome to Secret Diary of a Fall Guy. This might end up being the video to end all videos. Uh, it's been a little while since I filmed the video. I haven't had anything interesting to talk about. However, trying to navigate my way through this car park at Jeps Cross. Uh, it does say Jeps X on the sign, so I'm assuming I'm going down the right path. Yeah, it's a double lane road. Uh, nearly had a bingle a bit ago back there when I was killing in my car park there. I don't know what the lady was thinking, just let's go on some random wrong side of the road thing, try and get around my car, but I was already there. Uh, anyway, just been down to Toys R Us. Unfortunately, they didn't have what I was after. I'm trying to chase an AFX slot car set. I had one when I was a kid. Funnily enough, I also bought one in my previous life. Uh, and, and for my partner's son, I, I'm looking to get one as well for him because uh, he wants a race car. He wants something fun. Uh, look, slot car set. Every kid likes them. The only thing is they only sell the Scalatrix ones down there at the Toys R Us. So I'm not keen to buy Scalatrix because I think the cars are too big. You can get a bit less fun with them, in my humble opinion. Uh, there are those out there, serious slot car enthusiasts. I'm sure the Scalatrix one's probably their preference or some other random brand that they use instead. Uh, my preference has always been the Aurora AFX uh, set from when I had one when I was a kid. I asked my brother, I said, hey, Kurt, Where's my slot car set from when I was a kid? Uh, he unfortunately couldn't provide me any answers as to where it is or where it isn't. So it is what it is. Got Mr. Max in the car with us. Mr. Max is very silent at the moment because he's having a sleep. I just walked around Toys R Us with a sleeping baby on my shoulder. I'll tell you what, when they get to one, oh. It's quite funny actually, I've been learning a little bit of Indonesian or trying to learn some Indonesian. I've got the Audible app there, it's, it's a very slow, painful process because when you've been doing something for oh, 32 years of your life, um, you know, very hard to all of a sudden pick up and learn something new, like a, a new language all, all of a sudden. And I, I find it really awkward because the principles in Indonesian is very different with language than it is in Australia. Uh, so like we would say apple juice for example, they would say juice apple which you know, you describe what, what it is and then the flavour or the, the item comes after it. Or um, this book is what we would say for pointing at a book. This book, they would say book or any, uh, which, you know, is book this. Um, you know, I, I guess, you know, once I get my head wrapped around it a fair bit, I should be okay. But uh, learning language is, is a bit of fun. My partner speaks very fluent English otherwise, so uh, no issue with what she speaks. Um, purely doing this so our kids, I guess, can benefit as well because they're, they're half Indonesian. So the, the reality is for them, uh, you know, they need to know some culture too and, uh, you know, a bit of their own background, a bit of where they come from. Now, normally I'm a bit more road rage than this, but everyone's being very well behaved on the roads today. That's how up myself I am. That's right, guys. <laughs> Best driver in Australia right here. Yeah! Actually, I've got to behave myself because I've had three fines rack up in the last, or oh, maybe last 12 months easily. Uh, it was the end of last year, actually. I had three probably within an earshot of one another and unfortunately when it came down to it uh, I tried to contest one because one I really disagreed with but the other two I was clearly in the wrong um, and obviously you know when you're riding away to the revenue raises that are the police force uh, you know they're gonna say oh, well you know sorry we don't agree with your hypothesis on this so uh, pay the fine buddy or else so I'm hanging on to a few points uh, so I really have to behave myself for the next uh, what two years I think it is two and a half years um, so I can get my points back and my license and it's funny because no other state in Australia have I had any issues when I've been driving or I've lost any points per se uh, except for that one time actually there was this one time when I was in Queensland and uh, I got done when I was on my learner's permit for 
driving a car without a open license driver with me in the car, which was quite funny. Oh, you're a hero, mate. What a freaking hero you are. Oh, wow, and you got so far too. What a dickhead. What a fuck stick. Unfortunately, guys, you wouldn't have seen the green fuckwit up there. Uh, he's come out of nowhere in his Ford Falcon. What a fuckhead, seriously. And he didn't get very far because the traffic's uh, pretty chockers on the road at the moment. So uh, he got as far as uh, going up someone's ass and then pretty much staying there. Going to get a bite to eat now. Uh, and that's probably it. That's my time, guys. Uh, look, sorry it's been a while since I've done a video. I'm going to try and punch these out a lot, lot, lot more frequent than I have. And I will see you on the flip side.